I would say I was pretty ignorant about Muslims and I would say that um, I didn't know anything about the religion Islam. There's a lot of stereotypes that are attached to Judaism. I had a lot of like mystery around it and maybe a lot of fear as well because I associated it with some unhealthy stereotypes. My name is Mohammed Yahya. I'm Danny Raphael. And I'm a Muslim. I'm a Jewish MC. Proud and I'm member half of Lines of, of Faith, Lines of Faith. The UK's only Muslim Jewish hip hop collective. When people think of Islam and Judaism together, they often think about the internal conflicts that are going on, the conflicts that are going on in the Middle East, especially in Palestine and Israel. But the reality is, Muslims and Jews have been living side by side for thousands of years. Since I've started working with Muhammad and I've been learning more about Islam, is I realize so much of what Muslims do is almost identical to what Jewish people do. But, but people only focus on the negative, you know, on the negative things that are going on between Judaism and Islam. A big, big part of the work we do is all about breaking down ignorance. We've, we believe that if people actually learn the truth, then there's not going to be any hate or racism. The content to all of our songs is about what we have in common and how what divides us is real, but how we need to work through it so we can understand each other better. Music can bring people together, just the same way that we had that event and it was like full of Muslims, full of Jews, all under one room and everyone was enjoying themselves. But the reality is, if it wasn't under those circumstances, they'll probably be having arguments. Sometimes when we perform, people come up to us after and they're like in tears, like literally because this fear that people have of Muslims or Jews, whatever, and we, then we like convert that into like the unity and the love that we have and that we show anyone can have and people feel like a relief and it's like catharsis. Some things that are going on in the world are painful and I feel that I have to do this, I don't have an option, I have to speak about injustices, I want to speak out for those that don't have a voice, whether they're in Darfur, whether they're in Palestine, whether they're in Mozambique, Portugal, whether they're in Tibet, it doesn't matter. We are all part of a global community regardless of our faith. Do you understand? We're all created by the same God. We need to put our differences aside and focus on the similarities that we have. Be yourself, follow your own path, but don't think that gives you the right to look down on anyone else.